Good morning. Welcome back to the kitchen. I need to put on my apron. I'm getting ready to cook here. Um, but we're doing breakfast this morning. Um, I'm just doing a hearty breakfast sandwich. Uh, nothing too fancy, but you know how I do. So I got my Jets egg. I'm going to go ahead and use that as my egg substitute. For those who have watched me, you know. Um, but this morning, I feel like I want a little bit of tempeh bacon. So I'm using Light Life Smoky Bacon. Um, for those who aren't familiar with this, um, this is made with soybeans. I'll put the ingredients up here. Um, and it does have loads of potassium in it. Um, it does have some sodium. So we're going to do the serving size. Um, actually, I'm going to do half of it. It says you can do four strips. I'm doing two um, because, you know, just trying to cut a little bit of that sodium. And then to my lovely sandwich, I'm going to cut up some of those beautiful onions and peppers and avocado. I'm going to add a little bit of baby spinach and um, I have some leftover sourdough bread that I'm going to um, put and use as my bread for this morning. Um, typically, I like my Ezekiel bread, but um, I'm going to go ahead and finish up that sourdough. We don't want any bread going to waste. <laughs> so, hope everybody's having a good morning. All right, I'll place you here. I'll put my apron on. All right, don't want to get my clothes all dirty. Yep, so of course, you know, my pans are already hot and put you in focus. So I'm going to go ahead and cut up my onions nice and uh, fine, not too fine. I do want a little bit of crunch because it's going to get cooked in the actual egg, just egg. <laughs> And then my peppers. Yeah, this is what I like to have. Just, you know, I love my quinoa porridge and I love oatmeal and, um, you know, I like having those things in the morning. But sometimes you just want a quick little breakfast sandwich just to get you going throughout the day. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. And while these peppers and onions are cooking, I'm going to go ahead and take out my tempeh bacon. Another package you gotta fight with, boy. I tell you, light life. I'm gonna put you up there with field roast with the packaging. <laughs> Tiffany bacon um, is pretty easy to uh, deal with. Basically, you just if, if you're buying in bulk, you just freeze it. Um, but it's really delicate, so you can see the textures in it. This is what the bacon looks like. Okay. And like I said, um, due to the sodium in it, I'm going to cut my serving size to two strips instead of the serving size of four. So I just broke this one um, just to make sure I cut this. I want the flavor, but I don't need all that uh, extra sodium. All right, because we're going to add a little bit of seasoning to our eggs. You know how we do. Um, so I'm going to let that cook. Now, it's on high heat right now, um, but... As it cooks, I'll just flip it. You don't have to get aggressive with this like regular bacon um, where you just, you know, you're cooking it. Um, this takes a little bit of time, so you just take your time with it. You know, just check it every now and then. And by the time you're done with your eggs and everything, it'll be done on its own. Just flip it, okay? So, here are those eggs. Getting ready to go into these lovely, wish you could smell them green peppers and red onion what oh, purple onion they're really purple i don't know why we call them red all right give my just egg a little shake and remember guys this cooks up like scrambled eggs it is so delicious like it's become one of my favorite things to have for breakfast in the morning um it's so good now, my sourdough bread, this is from Pepper's Farms. Um, you can get whatever bread you like. Um, like I said, typically I eat my Ezekiel bread, but this is almost gone, so I don't want it to go to waste, so this is what we're doing for toast today. All right. I'll plug that in. This smells so good. And then on my lovely sandwich, um, I'm going to add some of my veganese because... You know, what's a sandwich without a little bit of mayo? 
Um, no tomato this morning. I'm gonna ditch that because I already had a little, half a green smoothie that I made this morning. Um, but this is like my breakfast that I'm eating. <laughs> so I smell the bacon already, my little tempeh bacon. Look at that. And this is what I mean. You can cook it on low heat. You don't have to get too aggressive with it because it doesn't take much to cook it. And it actually is almost done before our little eggs here. <laughs> So, there's that just egg. Now I'm gonna put a little bit of onion powder in here and a little bit of complete. Just for a little flavor, you know. A little bit of complete. Not a whole lot of that because it is a complete seasoning. And of course, what's eggs without a little bit of black pepper, okay? Yes. All right, so that's that. Our toast is toasting. Ooh, look at this, y'all. Tell you about that just egg. It cooks up just like scrambled eggs. Honey. Mmm. Y'all heard my toaster just go off. But guess what? We're going to pop that right back in there because I like a little bit of toast on my toast. I like my toast to be toasted. So that's what we're doing. Put you right back in there. Look at this. Yummy goodness. And just to give you a close up, look at that already. And that's been on there maybe a minute. Not even a full two minutes, just on the flat pan cooking. Oh yes, this is gonna be so good. No cheese today, uh, we don't need that. I do have some vegan cheese in there. Um, but eh, we're gonna ditch that today. I just want to taste my just egg and my tempeh bacon. Okay. All right. So next, check one minute. Oh yes. I like my toast a little golden. So that's what I was going for. Okay. So now we're gonna go ahead and work with our vegan knees while this is getting just about ready. So if you're a mayo lover, <laughs> I can't say enough commercials about my look, follow your heart vegan knees. Um, if you're looking for a mayo substitute, um, just to cut out the full fat milk um, or whole fat in regular mayo, follow your heart is a nice substitute. It is vegan mayo. Um, and as you can see, it, it spreads just like regular mayo. Actually, I think it tastes better than regular mayo. Um, and I'm a mayo girl, so, but I think it tastes better. I don't know, just the flavor in it, but to me it tastes better, but my preference. Um, so next I'm gonna go ahead and add my spinach. Mm. You can get as liberal as you want with this. This is your sandwich. Um, you can do whatever you want. Um, I'm just getting, you know, my greens in. I did have a smoothie already, um, but you can never get enough of this. So spinach is wonderful to me. Okay, now, before the spinach starts rolling all over the place, I'm gonna add my tempeh bacon first because I don't want that to move. So we're gonna take that. See how this is already broke up? I'm gonna break this one too. And lay that right on across there. Look at this goodness, y'all. This will keep me full until lunchtime. And I might just, I don't know what I'm gonna do for lunch today. Maybe a salad, we'll see. So there's the tempeh bacon going on there. Now here comes the messy part of this sandwich, which is, a messy sandwich is a good sandwich to me. A messy sandwich is a good sandwich. <laughs> All right, so we got our tempeh bacon on there. Next, our wonderful eggs. We're gonna scoop those up. Here comes the mess, and I hope it don't burn my hand. Ooh. Oh my gosh, y'all. Hey, if a little bit fall on the side, I don't care. This is my sandwich. <laughs> it can get as messy as it wants. And actually, I'm just gonna put the rest of that on the side. Um, I'll get it, give me a little fork, and that's how we're gonna do it. Hey, we, we're in the kitchen, that's it. No judgment here. 
And what's a breakfast sandwich without some lovely avocado? You gotta put some on there. I told you it's gonna be a big, messy sandwich. Look at that. Mm. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna bring you over for a close up because this is beautiful. Hey, and whatever doesn't make it on here is going on the side because guess what? I'm gonna eat that too. Look at that. Let me get my little piece right here. Mm. Hold on. Let me show you this. Beautiful. <laughs> Gorgeous. Don't you want to bite? Mm. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Ah. Let me put the lid on. The lid. Now, I know this looks big, but let me tell you something. This is my breakfast, and I typically don't eat lunch until my body says, hey, I'm hungry again. Um, I don't just eat because the clock says it's 12 o'clock, or it's one o'clock, or it's quote unquote lunchtime. When my body says, hey, I'm hungry, that's when I eat. So I just want y'all to see, because I know this is gonna be messy, um, but look at the inside of this. Isn't that a beautiful, beautiful, gorgeous breakfast sandwich? Don't you want some? It's so good. I would bite, I'm gonna bite this, but I don't want y'all talking about me, okay? Hold on. Mm. 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 Mm, mm, mm. Look at y'all. Mm. Man, get in that. Look at this. Mm. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. You know you want some. <laughs> you know you do. Let me tell you. Oh my God, it's so good. Mm. The layers of cheese. I'm well, cheese. The layers of eggs. I should have put some cheese on here. I did say I was going to. Well, that's okay. It's already bit now. But the layers of avocado, spinach. Look at that tempeh bacon. The onions, the peppers. If you don't make one of these, mm, that's my breakfast for the day. Mm. It's good. Tempeh bacon. Vegan eggs. A little bit of spinach. You have time for breakfast is what I'm saying. So go and make your breakfast sandwich. A good, nice one. Thick one. <laughs> All right, I'm going to go eat my breakfast, so see y'all next time. Have a good day. Last view.